Hey, um, so I am having problems right now because I did the play this year and it was so fun. And I knew this would probably be my last play ever. Um, so, because middle school. And now I'm getting into high school. So I had to choose between things. I've been doing sports forever. So I am going to do high school sports. I already know that I'm doing soccer no matter what. Here's where the problems kick in. I know I'm doing tennis because that's like the one season where nothing else is happening. So I'm just like, okay, let's do it. Okay, so the same season for girls, basketball and swim team, it's the same season. And I love doing them both so much. And I'm already struggling to choose that. And then I want to do another play because I love plays like I love theater class I mean like okay I I love performing but I don't think I'm going to unfortunately even though I love it and I'm not very good but like you know anyway um so I don't think I'm going to do a plan unfortunately but I I am taking theater class in high school so there's that which is a lot better so I can still perform a little bit but my problem kicks in at the fact that I have to choose between swim team and basketball. But, like, I'm still obviously choosing because I have a long time until summer. And I get to choose at the beginning, like, during winter. So, I have time. It's just like, here's my thing. I'm going to do basketball stuff over the summer. Over swim team. Because I've done basketball longer than swim team and stuff. But, so, the coaches, um, I know coaches in basketball and stuff, and they're really nice. Um, so I'm, like, thinking, I was leaning towards that, but then I got this offer from the swim team coach, like, hey, we still want you. It looks like it was flickering, my bad. It is flickering. Okay. But, um, like, I don't know where light's flickering. Anyway, um, so, I'm like, hey, okay. And the swim team coach is like, hey, I know that you will be very busy, but I'm giving you an offer to also do swim team if you want. Like, you can just come to practices whenever you're free. And I want to do it, but I also don't want to be super busy. So I'm like, I'm doing soccer. That's like in the discussion. Ooh. That was from a play, one of the props that I got. Um, oh, I have the whole crown too. I'll put that on in a minute. But like, I'm, I don't know, cause I love them all so much. I just wish I didn't have to choose. I am leaning in the direction where I play both sports and do basketball over swim, but like still a little bit of swim team. Although <laughs> my head does not like swim team very much because of the high buns and the swim caps. Okay, you want to know what's weird? Oh, I'll put this on for y'all. Um, so many people have never seen a swim cap in like real life. It's like rubber and stuff. I don't think I have one. No, I don't have one in here. I think I slay. Anyway, so I'm like, I don't know what to do, but um, I gotta keep the burn book. So I've, I'm gonna tell you guys what's going on in my head while deciding this, I guess, because some people are probably like, oh, it's easy. That's so easy. So my sister is two years ahead of me. And she got on varsity basketball her first year. And, um, so she was, like, she had a lot more stress on her. I'm not getting on varsity. That's already it. Like, because they already have so many good players now. Like, they just were out by the time my sister got in, obviously. So I was like, okay. And I'm fine 
with him not having room for me on varsity because she was stressed out and there was a lot of drama that year. But I've been playing basketball my whole life and I I love it and stuff. And um, there won't be drama on those teams. And, you know. Um, but, like, I'm also, like, I love it. I've done swim team a little bit less than compared to basketball, obviously. But I love it. And, like, I'm decent at them. Like, I'm not really good at either one, necessarily. Like, I'm not really good at plays either. But, like, I like it. So... I just don't know what to do with my life anymore, guys. Because, like, called it, knew there would be more knots. But, like, um, I just love them all so much. And I wish there was time for everything. My dad did tell me this. In the summer, there's, like, some plays at a theater nearby. That they do. And, oh, one second. I was thinking about that in, in the summer. So it would, like, just barely work around my schedule. Obviously, I'd be busy. But I also don't want to take away time for vacations and stuff. So it's like, hey, you have to choose if you want to do stuff you love. Or if you want to spend, get more time at home. Like, I want to have more time at home, obviously. Like, I feel like everyone does. But, like really hard to choose because I'm a very active person like one time in the summer whenever I wasn't doing anything I went kind of crazy because well no not in the summer like there's an off season sometimes for basketball and stuff yeah f between basketball and um soccer and I did the play this year, so it wasn't that. And I, like, acted like a jerk. Because, like, I guess, like, I didn't have anything to do. I don't know why I acted like a jerk. And then the play, I'm also really sad because I met some really nice people that I became friends with. Oh, gosh. Oh, sorry, that was chapstick. I was like, what is blocking the view, like? You can't tell this is like actually really hard because like I know I don't have to decide now but I'd rather just get the decision over with. I'm really leaning towards taking up that offer but I also heard that the high school swim team is like really fun and everyone that does it enjoys it even if they've never done swim team before because like the coaches are apparently great. I actually know both of the coaches and they're both fun people. Like, one of them um, runs our pool, and our pool, unfortunately, is getting ready to be run down and stuff, because, like, it keeps leaking water and going somewhere. I don't know where it's going. I'm trying to think. Like, <sighs> guys, I would recommend, like, okay, obviously, like, okay, the reason why I'm doing tennis is because I started up a year ago or something like that. Okay, if, first. I keep going off track. Almost out of Vaseline. Alexa, set an alarm for 6.30 a.m. tomorrow. Alarm set for 6.30 a.m. tomorrow. Alexa, set a timer for 10 minutes. Sorry, my mom texted. Starting now. Okay, um. Like. Where was I thinking? Hmm. Interesting. I run off track. But I met a lot of nice people in the play. And, um, I became friends with them. I feel like this is the most friends I've had in a while because my best friends ditched me in sixth grade. And then some of them are acting like jerks, and I'm pretending to be their friend, kind of. So, it's 
because I'm avoiding drama. And I'm not going to talk about that person. Oh, Alexa. Cancel my alarm. 6.30 a.m. Alarm canceled. Alexa, say alarm for 6 a.m. Alarm set for 6 a.m. tomorrow. I'm going to text my grandpa. For FCA. Like, I'm a very busy person, so I would recommend, like, okay, the only reason why I did, um, tennis is because I didn't like volleyball in the first place. Um, so then I, like, was like, I want to find a sport during that off season, and so I found tennis. I didn't want to roll as a kid, but I wasn't very good. Anyway, um, so I would recommend finding one sport that you love, so for me, that's soccer. Or football, however you, you call whatever you call it. Good for you if you call it football. I'm stuck in America over here. No, I'm joking. Um, but like find something that you love and then don't get like caught up on other things. I don't recommend it. Take two sports and other and a, a, other extracurricular activity. And then I'm also taking like shop classes and stuff, so My future husband's gonna be lucky. I can build stuff they don't have to. <laughs> I'm joking. No, they're not gonna get lucky. I'm over here having like a. I'm having a young life crisis. I'm only 14. I turned 14 four days ago. Four days being 14. This is what I get. I swear. These are gonna lie for flashing. Oh. Anyway, um, thanks for listening to my rant. Um, love y'all so much. Have a great day or go to bed if it's time for you to go to bed. Stop scrolling. Stop looking at videos. Like, girl. That's why I leave my phone upstairs. Anyway, love you guys. Oh, I haven't done a heart in a while. Love you guys. Have a great day, and please do not make the same mistake that I did falling in love with like 10 different things.